When I was in high school, like my mom and I kind of came to the agreement we'd start visiting schools after I got accepted, which happened right around when everything COVID-wise happened. I was looking at Lewis and Clark originally, but it just came down to like not being able to visit and the idea of staying close to home in California, you can go to a JUCO for free if you graduate high school in the state of California, so that was kind of a plus. My JUCO West Valley College is 15 minutes from my parents' house, which felt really, really close, but at the same time, it was really nice to stay close to home. Um, the transition for like academics and tennis, I think as much as I didn't want to, I kind of needed that like in-between step. Um, like, I don't know, it was really nice to go to um, a school and have that environment where I'm so close to my professors and um, coaches and everything. So I definitely wanted to look for something similar when I was looking at Lewis and Clark. It was amazing. I had a really good coach and really good teammates. I think a lot, it was just a lot of learning um, tennis wise. Like I got to play against some amazing players um, and because Juco tennis is a really mixed bag. Sometimes you play someone amazing and sometimes you play someone and you're like, okay, I definitely don't have to try a lot to win this match. It was just good to play against lots of different players and learn a, ton, learn a ton, even if I wasn't like always winning, like just good to learn um, a lot tennis wise. And I also think I just grew a lot as a player then I might not have had that experience if I came straight to a four year out of high school because I just learned so much from my coach. I really liked that West Valley was really, not small, but like small enough and close knit, like um, that you can really get a, be close with your professors and your coaches. And there's a lot of people out there that wanna help you. And so I definitely wanted something similar here. And I definitely found that I feel like here, like my professors know me by name and it was like that at West Valley too. And I have really, like the coaching staff here is really good. and. I obviously had a great relationship with my last coach, so I definitely wanted something similar. I feel like the transition is definitely daunting when you first when I first got here, um, but I think my teammates have been super welcoming and stuff, which is really nice. I had got along really well with my last teammates, and it's been nice to build those relationships with my new teammates. And I also am really appreciative of my professors because I was upfront with them in the beginning that I just came from a different school and just came from like different expectations in class and stuff. So it might take me a little longer to get used to the Lewis and Clark way of going through classes. And my professors last semester were super nice about like just helping me understand what goes into getting good grades here and stuff. Juco tennis is very all over the place, especially outside of California. But um, here it's like everybody is solid. Like there's nobody that you're like, she does not know how to play tennis. Everyone here is good. And so it's definitely really, really fun. I enjoy the competition, um, but yeah, it's been, it's been great to like see that like next level of competition. Um, but it's all just still, still learning. I feel like I'm learning every day when I go play a match. I'm majoring in bio and minoring in environmental studies. And I would love to go into like marine bio, probably grad school, but the thought of that is really daunting, so. Not really sure where I'm going with that. I worked at an aquarium in high school and the first years of college, and I just really learned a lot like about animals and obviously teaching people, because a big part of my job was interacting with visitors and supervising them when they touch animals and touch tanks, which is always a little chaotic with little kids and grabby hands. I would love to work with whales, um, research whales. I know um, that's a really big, daunting field, but um, I just, I'm really fascinated by whales. I think it's really cool how um, whales are interacting with people, whether they want to or not, and at the same time, we, we got to do something to protect whales, so.